Hello Scorpio. Thank you very much for tuning into this week's read. For the main part of the read, I'm using the Star Tarot by Kathy McLeland. Love this deck. Uh, there's Kathy's website if you would like it. Supportive Oracle Cards, Chakra Wisdom Oracle Cards by Tori Hartman, illustrated by Gretchen Raish Baskin. Uh, their websites in the back are ToriHartman.com and uh, I can't read it. What is it? WatkinsPublishing.com or .co.uk or just throw it on the floor. Okay. Uh, hopefully it's, you can see it. The .com is down here, down there if you want to see it. Let's see if I can not throw things all over the place and continue with the reading. Is that a precursor for your reading? What's going on? <laughs> I did have a couple cards, you know, flop out, which they're face down, so I don't know if they are yet, but we'll find out. Um, all of this? What's, what's, okay. We may have a lot of cards for you. There's, is there like a side? What's going on? It's not, I don't think it's bad. Um, Eight of Swords and the Justice card on their side. Ooh, okay. Um, the situation, you're going to make it what you want. That's the first thing I'm getting. It's kind of like, you know what? If this isn't going to work, then maybe I could do something else. Um, <laughs> this Ace of Pentacles, you know what you want. So, it's all about what is it worth to make it happen. You know what you want. What is it worth to make it happen? I keep getting that. And it's kind of like, you're addressing that like, well, <laughs> okay, this is how it's coming through. Take it with a grain of salt. If I play by the rules, then I'm kind of stuck. But, you know, if you want to make an omelet, sometimes you got to break some eggs. Take it with a grain of salt. That's how it's coming through. So... It's almost like, uh, it's kind of like, well, whose rules? It's kind of like I'm feeling that kind of energy. Like, those are their rules, but I have my own rules. So whose rules am I really breaking? This is getting like, I don't know. I feel like it's one of those things kind of like, you know, just because it's, just because it's a rule doesn't mean I believe in it. And who's making these rules anyway? Um... Yeah, Scorpio makes their own rules. Don't y'all make your own rules? I feel like you're one of those that makes your own rules. Kind of like, let me decide for myself if I think that's right. You know what I mean? Um, Scorpio makes their own rules. I keep getting it. It's coming in quite strong at the moment. And I'm looking at the whole situation and it's kind of like, eh, if I, if I break their rules... Then I get caught for it. How bad is that, really? There, I am really, like, getting into this energy kind of like, I'm not into everybody else's rules. I'm into my rules. I have my rules. And when I want to live by my rules, I know other people might have an issue with that. How bad is that, really, if it falls apart, though? If people, you know, catch me breaking their rules, well, how bad is that, really? Um, really strong energy with this. I don't feel like I'm willing to place by somebody else's ru rules anymore. Okay, there's hiccups, which that's usually like an indication of some type of negative energy for me. Woo. Two of Wands with the Dissipating. You're going to know this before you even do this, but you're like, it'll pass. They may get bent out of shape with what I do, but they'll get over it and they'll move on. Um, that's the two of wands, but I'm noticing we're only seeing one of them push forward. Um, especially, is this that one? Are these in order? Please tell me these are in order. I think they are. Yeah. I think these are in order. Sometimes, um, 
sometimes people do the wheel and, and they just throw the signs in in any order. It drives me nuts. I don't know why it does, but it just does. <laughs> so I'm looking at it, I was like, is this in order? Because I think it is. I think it's fine. Um, I don't know why I'm getting nitpicky all of a sudden. Oh, that's that energy you're dealing with. There's rules, there's structure, this is how this is supposed to go, you're breaking the rules, this is not what was agreed to, no, 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 wrong, 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 and you're like, yeah, wrong is fun. <laughs> I'm going to have a good time being wrong, you just have a, you know, get bent out of shape all you gotta, but I'm going to do what I gotta do. Um, ooh. Yeah, because I'm seeing rules, it's like the Two of Wands, and I'm like, the Two of Wands isn't really Earth, but then I was noticing this energy. This can talk about an Earth energy. Uh, can very easily talk about an earth energy being bound and stuck and cannot move and do not change and do not do and no, 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 no. And we got boundary, boundary, boundary. And you're like, yeah, that boundary's funny. Good luck with your boundary. I gotta go. Um, good luck with your boundary. They feel like this is not how the plan is supposed to go. This is not what was agreed upon in, in their opinion. You're like, ah, uh, yeah, well, maybe not. But hey, I'm going to do what I got to do. I feel like you're moving on and you're going to try to, you're going to make the decision you need to make. You're going to try to kind of work it out with them. Kind of like, listen, hey, I understand those are your rules. I'm not into those rules anymore. I'm going on. I got something else I got to do. Um, you got the three of cups. You're going to try to make it work. Kind of like, listen, hey, I got to do what I got to do. This isn't working for me anymore. And I feel like you're also looking at the history of this, especially with the three of pentacles, like, Listen, I'll make it up to you later. I can't do this anymore. You're suffocating me. I can't do it. These rules are not working for me. I keep getting this thing about rules. It's like this whole reading has been like rules, rules, rules. And you're like, forget your rules. I'm done. Um, they are going to have a lot to say about this. They kind of, I don't know. I'm just trying to be a little bit more gentle with it. Because I see them coming forward like, no, no, Scorpio, Scorpio, blah, 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 blah. Very upset, but also, like, I feel like they're also, if they know you well enough, they realize they can say all they want, but you've made your decision. And once you've decided what you're going to do, that's what you're going to do. And that's how it is. Um, they, I feel them making a big issue of it, but I also feel like, once they realize, okay, like you're, because I see you, you're just listening. I feel like you're, you're willing to listen. You're trying to get along with them, so you're listening. You're kind of like, yeah, I'll listen. I'll listen. Okay, you got something to say. But once they realize, like, they can say what they want, you've made your decision. I feel like they're going to let it go. Um, I also see this card coming in, and I'm trying to understand exactly. Yeah, well, I feel like this is obvious what this is, but. They're going to try to, you know, make you feel like, you know, what you're doing is wrong and you're doing something that's making their life difficult. And, uh, they're kind of playing the victim card with this. It's literally a card that says victim on it. And I feel like they're going to kind of walk away from you for a little while. They might just flat out ignore you for a while. Um, they're going to be kind of ticked. And they're going to just kind of like cut you out of their life for a little while. I feel like this does kind of shock you that that's how they're handling this for some reason. Whatever it is, you're like, you feel like they're overreacting. You feel like they're overreacting. That's how they're overreacting. Okay. And they just, they don't want to deal with you for a while. And they're just kind of, they're kind of like, you don't want to play by the rules? Well, me either. And they're just kind of like, I feel like they're mad. They're doing this because they're mad. Kind of like, all right. You don't want to play by rules? Yeah, me either. And they're just kind of like shutting the door and walking away. Like, all right, you don't want to play by the rules? I don't either. Um, do what you need to do. The situation will work out. Um, whoever this is, I feel like they're, they're just going to get involved in something else and they're going to ignore you for a while. It's going to, I don't know, it's not going to last. Whatever they're getting involved with, I don't know. That seems to be its own situation. 
but I don't feel like this is a permanent dismount, disconnect, dis something. They're gonna get, they'll get over it at some point. I, I get that. It seems like you, whatever you're dealing with, I feel like you know that they're gonna get over it. It just feel like you're shocked that they're just like, well then fine, shut door, bye. Um, they are pretty mad, but they're walking away for a while. Though they will come back. Um, whoever this energy is, I feel like you got to kind of like think about this a little bit. And when they come back around, I feel like this is something where you have to be more in control. Whatever the situation was this time around, I don't feel like you had the level of control that worked. It just didn't work. You needed, I feel like you need more control in these situations. And if you don't, we're going to head for these problems again. And this does feel like this energy is going to come back around. But I feel like you need to be more in a power position the next time it comes back around. If you can't be for whatever reason, like if this is a work thing, address it right off the, the bat. Like this isn't going to work for you because you're more of a leader energy. You can only go along and follow for so long, but you have to have some sort, some sort of control over what you're doing or this isn't going to work. Um, and I feel like this is, again, this rule thing. Other people's rules doesn't don't work for you. If you're able to like get into this and they're like, well, that rule makes sense, I agree with that. This rule makes sense, I agree with that. That's one thing. But if there's rules a part of this situation, you're like, I don't really think that's right, but I'll go along with it for now. There's a shelf life for that. And I feel like that might have been what happened here. Um, so when it does come back around, you got to be in a stronger position or you're going to keep repeating this pattern and it's not going to be good. Um, anything else? All right. I'm going to shut this down here. I hope that helps. Thank you for watching. If you'd like a direct reading from me, shoot me an email, jamesforastral at gmail.com. That's james, the number four, astral at gmail.com. If you're interested in the donation information, that's below. Same email. Thank you for watching and have a great day.